Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. Massive coral bleaching events hit Guam in 2013 and 2014, and projections for 2016 are looking even worse. According to Community Coral Reef Monitoring Program Coordinator Mary Bell Kanata, residents can step up to help report the condition of Guam reefs. You don't have to have um, a lot of technical knowledge about coral reefs. You don't have to be a marine biologist or aspire to be one. If you just go in the water, if you're fishing, snorkeling, paddling, diving, any of those activities where you're in the water and you can see um, coral, because you can see it um, even if you're above the surface, uh, any of those, um, any of that information can actually really help. An Eyes of the Reef Marianas training this Wednesday aims to teach residents how to report sightings of coral bleaching or corals suffering from diseases, human impact, and other abnormalities. Researchers are also interested in finding corals that are resilient to temperature changes so these species can be reproduced. It's one way we can they can all contribute to helping our islands and our reefs to make sure they're, you know, they're as healthy as we can make them despite all these impacts and, um, and impacts like uh, climate change that are a little above us. To report observations or sign up for the Eyes of the Reef training, residents can visit EORMarianas.org. The training takes place at the University of Guam Marine Laboratory, Classroom 205 from 6 to 8 p.m. on July 27. Upcoming field trainings at the Outrigger Hotel Beach are also planned for August 6th and 11th. To learn more, you can call 646-1905. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Issa Baza. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.